Hi, this is Linz from Sweet Natured and this is our review of the Hydrotherapy Suite and the Retreat on board P&O's Iona. As always, I'm joined by Marky. Hello. Hello, who put the video together and this is my first time watching, so let's see what we can see. As you said, Linz, in this particular video, we're doing two separate reviews, the Hydrotherapy Suite and the Retreat. But they're kind of related. Yeah, they're both areas that you pay a little bit more for and the two are relaxing, which is why we've bundled them together. Yes. So we've just come down the steps to where we are now from the spa because the actual spa facilities and the hydrotherapy suite are, are set the deck below it. Yes. In a private area. So if you're going for any treatments as well, this is where you'll end up coming down to. Yes. Now, before we get into the hydrotherapy suite area, just opposite it is a relaxation lounge. Yes, yeah, so um, for when you've had a massage or if you just want to sort of cool down following the hydrotherapy suite, I get it. We yeah, never so went can, in. We didn't because you still had comfy areas to sit in the hydrotherapy suite, but you can come and use that as well. And we were the only you. ones there. We were the only ones there. I mean, people will see as we get through into this. We chose to have a, an early morning session, which I think started at quarter past eight. Yes. And, and it's for two hours that you get for the £20 per person. Yeah. And so we were there 8.15 till 10.15. On the port day. Yeah. And that's an important thing that we would say as a top tip. Yeah. If you're not planning on getting off at the port, or you're going to get off later. Yes. Perfect time to go down to here, because it's much busier when it's a sea day. M much busier. The change rooms, as you will have seen as we walk past, you get your towels, you get robes, and you get slippers in there as well. Yes. Into the actual hydrotherapy suite. Look at it. It's so lovely. I have to say, without any spoilers before we get to the review at the end of it, it's probably the best hydrotherapy suite that we've been to on a ship that I can think of. You said that. Um, I preferred it to ones like Cunard or NCL. Cunard's nice. Cunard's nice, but this was all in one area. It was all in one area. Um, yeah, and you know what? I'll let you, I'll let you have that. Are you agreeing with me? I am. Oh, fantastic. So you've got some um, experienced showers on the left. I think they've got five or I think there's five different settings in there from sort of misty and that smells of eucalyptus and mints to tropical showers. Just a nice place to yeah. sort of start out your day. What was nice, and I don't know if you noticed this at the time, but I did when I was putting this together. <laughs> steam. You can't see much in the steam room. Um, normally, if you're down in um, this sort of facility first thing, yeah. A lot of the equipment, like the sauna or the steam room, are not up to heat yet. Yes. These were all ready as they, soon as we walked in. They were in. so ready to go. And look at it. They've got proper sun lounges, not just the storm beds, so you can relax afterwards and make yourself comfortable, yeah. read a book, have a drink. Lovely. It is. It's a really, really nice... I mean, you can see again here, just saying what I said, that how warm they all are straight oh, away. Oh, it was so nice. And if we'd have decided... Where that fancy we could hire out the whole thing, goodness knows how much that would not that we could ever afford it. I'm no. just saying how lovely that it was just uh, and us. And we had this for the full two hours, all by entirely ourselves, entirely to ourselves. And can remember a staff walked in at one point, yeah, and they said, like, Oh, sorry, and then walked <laughs> back out. <laughs> uh, but and you've got you can go back out into the corridor and enter here, or you can come in through those doors on the left hand side as well, through like. the changing rooms because there's a yeah, yeah, you've got showers changing. and toilets in there, etc. Yeah, loose. But yes. you don't have to come back out no. into the main hallway if you don't want, unless you're going into the relaxation room. Yeah, and it look how lovely it is. Now, there's some big open windows there that's part of the walking down the corridor. But you don't get anyone who's not going to the spa walking no, past. No, you don't. You're not. Oh, oh. What? And you press the cold one there, as you can probably tell by <laughs> oh, your face. no. <laughs> I don't. People won't be able to hear the sound because obviously we mute it. I think they can tell from my face. There, there was swearing going on on that clip. No. Yeah, the way you swore. No. I, I'm sure people won't Now, this was like a you. bath. It was like bath water. It was so warm. It and was lovely. lovely. It was lovely. And just for us. It was. And just to reiterate again, this cost £20 per person for the <laughs> two hour session. Which That's. Very, very reasonable. And we stayed for the two hours as well. We did, the full two hours. I mean... I don't think that they kicked us out. I, I, don't, I don't know. 
The only reason we went is because on the same day, and you're going to see this in the second part of the review. Oh, what am I we'd... doing? <laughs> we'd also booked the retreat, so we're having yes, a relaxation day. day. Yes. Otherwise, we probably would have stayed in there a little bit longer. Or as just well. see now, yeah, we could. The bits and pieces go on and off at different times. Yes. So that shower's not on all the time. No, it's not. No, they the have different a... jets come on at yes. different times. Yeah. So you can sort of move around and. It, it's not a quiet place because of the hydrotherapy pool. So if you're wanting somewhere to just relax... But there is a little quiet corner with some nice plush sun lounges that we There is, we but use. you'll still hear the Yeah, you the will, yeah. So if you were nodding, you'll probably hear it come on quite a bit. Yeah, there's not a button that you have to press to switch it on. It's just on rotation yes. all the way through. What have you given it? Well, I said first off, as we said before, it's one of the best ones we've ever visited on a cruise. I can take it outside of a cruise. It's one of the best ones we've ever visited. Does, that's all... Like you say, it was all together. It was seemed it ticks. Oh, you've given it nine. I have given it a nine. It ticks. Pretty I'm much just trying to bones. think how we could have got that extra point. I don't know. Cocktails. Free cocktails. <laughs> oh, that's why. So just before we go into the retreat, you yes. can just take a second to invite you to subscribe if you've not done already, and you can also follow us on most of the major social media: Facebook, social, uh, Twitter. And Instagram at Sweet Natured. Thank you for that, darling. And thank you if you have subscribed. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. The retreat. So it's available to you. You book it for the full day from 8 a.m. to 8 p.m. And I thought it was six. No, it rates late. Wow. Okay. Uh, And you, because it were a twelve-hour period that we could use it for when we were on. It might be different depending on what cruises you're on. No. But it was forty pound per person. Is... So for our day in here, yes. it costs the two of us eighty pounds. Oof. Which seems quite expensive when you compare it to the hydrotherapy suite, but you're in that for two hours, you're in this for the full day. Yes. It does include uh, various food and snacks. So there was breakfast. There's breakfast, there's lunch, lunch and there's an afternoon tea there is. if you want it. You're gonna see the menu shortly, it's quite a limited choice. The day that we went in, again we were in port. Yeah. So it didn't get much busier than this. No, there was a few. There was a, a few, few more came in later in. on, but not many. Because at this point now, it's about half past ten. Yeah. So I think there were another couple already in here before us, um, and that's kind of it. There's some various. Uh, I think there were flavored waters, if there I remember was, right. Yes. There. And they had some juices and smoothies in the cabinet um, that you could help yourself to as well. Mm-hmm. It is a serviced area, so there's staff in there all the time. However. I didn't feel very serviced. I won't comment on that. <laughs> but it, the service of these sort of things that we've been in, like the sanctuary retreats on other ones, havens, all that sort of stuff, it was probably the worst service that we've had. And it's not that it was bad. They no. didn't do anything bad. The They just weren't around. We had to go out and get a drink ourselves. They, yeah. they didn't offer any food. We had to go ask for it. Um, it, they it did just, with the afternoon tea, they delivered that. That was the only one. Yeah. Uh, it didn't feel as special. It didn't. And when you're spending you know, £80 for the two of you, when the rest of the ship's empty, because everyone's off at the port, then you want to feel a little bit sort of more special. Yes. Now, the the whirlpool, again, is the same as the other whirlpools. It goes off... After a minute. After a minute. Which I, I would have thought in... In the retreat area, it just stays on if you press it. Yes. Uh, menu says you can say the, there was one thing for breakfast, a couple of things for uh, daytime at any point, and, dessert, and then afternoon tea. And they're served in like a Tupperware box. Yeah. They weren't on plates. There were no crockery with it. No. You'll, I mean, you'll see that in a second. You can just go help yourself to some of these if you want to do. Uh, as I said, we never no. got offered them. No. Uh, even in the morning. But you can just go help yourself to them as well. But again, I would expect it to be offered to you. Yes. The afternoon tea, that's how it comes. And also, you don't book your beds. You just get the beds that are available. You do. Yeah. Now, yeah. Cause... Which is fine, because you're there early enough. You get what you want. Yeah. But for me, it wasn't as good as we would have expected. In there. there were no changing rooms. There, there were, were no toilets. No, no loo. So we ended up, and this might be a good tip, actually, we ended up with dressing gowns, because, of course, we had them on when we went out to get changed. And there we had dressing gowns. Five? Yeah, so I'll get a five out of ten. Yeah, as you said, we took the dressing gowns down to the room. 
afterwards. We handed them back in at the end of it, but we kept them for the rest of the cruise. <laughs> uh, but it, it's just not quite good enough. We've had we for me nicer. And that brings us to the end of another video. Oh goodness, that went quick. Thank it you, did. darling. Oh, where's my Cheers, chin? Lens. Cheers, darling. And thanks for watching, everyone. Thank you, and have a lovely day.